Hey YouTube, what's up? It's 2.30 a.m. Um, I don't see this time very often. Go for here. I know, I'm like so depressed. I'm not emo. I'm stuck. I'm talking to a buddy of mine tonight. You know, mentioned the fact that I'm jealous of my brother because my brother has had these pretty amazing friends, kind of somewhere where he belongs for all these years, and I've had that. But I've never had that. Um. And the funny thing about it is, although there are days where I really want that, I really want the, um. I want the niche. You know, I want the group where I fit into where I belong. But overall, I really don't want to belong in a sense where overall I like who I am. Overall, I believe myself to be an individual who doesn't necessarily need others um I pause because in my head all the different aspects and the ways that I look at things are going through but I can't translate them all onto these videos because they would end up being hours upon hours long of me trying to relay the logic and the rationales that go through my head of how and why I feel this way. I really should be a psychiatrist. But anyways, I was telling my buddy about how I told my brother the other day that I was jealous of him for the fact that he has these friends. And even though I have lots of material things, I would trade them for that one person, one, because I don't do well in many numbers. Like, I, I get along, I can entertain, but for long periods of time, I don't do that very well. I'm not, I'm not sure typical, I use this in a broad, broad sense, girl who has that circle of girlfriends. I think, I think girls tend to be more social creatures and, you know, they tend to have their packs. I've always had my groups of people but I've been, I've been very independent inside of those groups. Um, I can't believe I've been talking for four minutes now. <sighs> but anyways, so he asked me if that's what I really want. And I really don't want that. I want the one person and that I really connect with on a friend level, on whatever level. Probably preferably friend and relationship if we're talking ideal um, because that would satisfy the friend loneliness aspect and the whole sexual side because I am human and I still do have sexual desires. Not as many as I used to but 
I do have my deals. Um, not that anyone really needed to know that. Another thing, these videos. I probably sound preachy to people. Um, but this, these videos are for as much my benefit as anyone who may or may not watch these. Um, when I talk about certain things, about my blessings in life or anything like that, I am trying to remind myself and to convince myself that these are all things to be thankful for, which they really are, and to appreciate. And those are things that should be focused on rather than focusing on what I no longer have. Um, you know, I don't know, maybe, maybe this translates, maybe not, maybe people take me as a over world preachy snob even maybe take me as that kind of person but it's very much so not the kind of person I am everyone goes through their own shit everyone has their ways of dealing with things some people better than others. I get stuck in the past. I always have been this way. I do not let things go. I... Both my parents are this way. And I absolutely hate it. Because I know. I know. I have to let these things go. But it's not that easy. It's not like that. Drives me nuts. Um. So basically, I don't know. I'm probably going to be that person who spends her life alone. Um. I really always have had that feeling. I guess, and that's probably why I keep fighting it, and but I just accept it, and may be less miserable, um, but I probably am going to be alone, for one reason or another, um, I'm okay with that in some ways, some ways, not so much. Uh, I know that over my lifetime, I'll have rendezvous and little moments of passion and cuteness. Um, but it's probably nothing that amounts to much seriousness. Um, why? Maybe that's the way I want it. Maybe... I don't want to go through certain things anymore. Maybe I don't want to take the chance of bringing people into my issues. You know, save them from me. And maybe I view that as in the same way with friendship as well. I, I, I don't know. Still make people laugh. I still care from time to time. Life isn't bad. It's just not great. It's just in the middle in the limbo stage. Take care, YouTube.